This video was sponsored by PickleballCentral.com. More about them at the end of the video. All right, welcome back to Davis Pickleball. Today we're gonna to be doing a review on the Selkirk Power Air Series. Selkirk released a new line recently, and uh, here we have the Selkirk S2 Vanguard. This one is a little bit of a wider shape. And then we have the Epic, which is definitely the widest in their lineup. So this will probably be a bit more for a bigger sweet spot and a bit more control. And lastly, we have the Selkirk Invicta Vanguard. And uh, I think this one is probably the most popular one on the market. You see a lot of players like Mike Tyson, or not Mike Tyson. <laughs> We have players like Tyson McGuffin. I always call him Mike Tyson, probably just because he's such a beast. Um, but anyways, we have the Invicta Vanguard. This is an elongated shape, um, definitely a bit of a power paddle. So uh, Dylan and I, we're gonna do a review on these. Let's hop right into it. All right, so I'm gonna try out the Vanguard Midweight Power Air. Um, so first impressions, I uh, really like the color. I think it looks pretty awesome. Um, so it's a little shorter and it seems a little wider. So. Like Ed said, I think there's going to be a, a wider, uh, a bigger sweet spot here. And, you know, in terms of uh, the speed of it, I think it is pretty aerodynamic. But really, I'm looking for it to have a good amount of power and a decent amount of touch. Pretty nice stock grip, so feels pretty good in your hand. Decent weight, not too heavy. I wouldn't say an incredibly light paddle either, but um, looking forward to it. Oh, got him, yeah. Way too good. Invicta, baby. All right, so much to talk about. Yeah, these are, these are cool. Uh, first, I'll talk about the S2 Vanguard Power Air. Um, so this one is, has the shortest handle. So if you're a player who likes to kind of choke up, either with that ping pong grip or you have that shorter handle, this is definitely the one for you. I kind of I felt like this was maybe the softest of the three as well, so definitely had a ton of touch. And I felt like at the kitchen with like quick net play, I kind of had the ability to speed up the ball really easily and be ready for that next shot. So really maneuverable, pretty aerodynamic, and definitely really good soft touch. With the Epic Vanguard um, Power Air, I felt it was pretty similar, so a little longer of a handle than the S2. So a little longer, so if you're someone who likes that longer handle, this one's a little nicer to you, but they're pretty similar. I would say this has a little more pop. So the Epic has a little more pop. I felt like I could get a little bit more on my drives, but still has a good amount of touch. Um, lastly, the Invicta. This was personally my favorite. I'm more used to that elongated uh, length, whereas these are a little wider, a little shorter. So I like the Invicta a lot. I think this is one of the more popular ones and longer handle. I feel like I could reach more with the ball um, and has a lot of pop. So this one's more of the power paddle out of these three. Still good touch. I felt like I had pretty good control on my dinks and my drops, but I definitely feel like I could put the ball away and speed it up with this one. All of them had pretty similar spin, I would say. So good, pretty good grit um, where I can roll the ball or slice the ball where I want to. All in all, I really like them, you know, maneuverable, um, good touch, good power that varies. All right, so a little quick shout out to our sponsors, Pickleball Central. If you don't know about them already, they are the best place to get pickleball gear. They have awesome discounts. They have basically all the paddles you could possibly think of. We'll put a link in the description below. Make sure to go check them out. All right, so here are my thoughts about the differences between the three Power Air Series paddles. Obviously, they all look pretty similar, but they're gonna feel a little bit different when you play with them just because of the shape of them. I would say if you are a beginning player still working on your touch, I would recommend a bit of the wider paddle such as the S2 Vanguard. This one's gonna feel like you're gonna have a little bit more forgiveness to your paddle just because it's a little bit wider. But if you're like a more advanced player and you're looking for a bit of more edge, a little bit more hot sauce to your pickleball game, I would definitely recommend the Invicta. This is gonna be a little bit thinner in terms of the width, so you're not gonna have as much forgiveness to your shots, but at the other side of the coin, you're gonna have a lot more power and you're gonna have a lot more pop to your ball. So this paddle, if you are a player who likes to drive maybe, who likes to play a bit more aggressive, Invecta is your boy right here. 
Go check out these paddles. Grab your own at pickleballcentral.com. If you wanna play competitively, these are definitely great paddles. Go check them out.